Hey there everybody, this is Eric from Outer Limitless. And it's Carlos from Daily Carry Solutions. We're here in Atlanta today to cover Blade 2019. Now there is a lot of material to cover between June 7th and June 9th. These three days have a lot coming, so stay tuned. You're gonna like it. Hey guys, what's up? Uh, I have a special video today. It is not on a knife designer, but a definite knife pro in the flesh. It's Zach from Blade HQ, guys. How's it going, guys? <laughs> so. What do you think about Blade 19? I mean, how, how do you feel about the overall just, yeah, I mean, I know you've been in the video room yeah, a lot. Yeah, um, and here we are, oh, yeah. you're trying to enjoy <laughs> <Yeah>. yourself. <laughs> no, no, I'm not, you know, working, working. Uh, yeah, no, uh, I've seen a lot of cool stuff doing the video ends, right? Yeah. So I've seen some stuff from kind of the big boys, and then today's my day to like go around and see some of the smaller stuff. Nice, um, okay. But I, I mean, you know, every year, man, I'm stoked every year, you know, like, I do, I do this stuff on YouTube and some people are like, ah, does he really like this knife? He said he liked this other one. I just love knives a lot. <laughs> Amen to that. Amen so yeah, that. I've been stoked. I've been stoked on it. Have you? What have you guys seen that you've been stoked on? Oh man, um, I, I mean, I wanted to go ahead and see some of the Isham designs yeah. at Civivi, yeah. but by the time I had gotten there, they had all sold out. Yeah, uh, I, I, I was I was gonna pick up a McKenna. Yeah. No. Uh, oh, no how about those? Yeah. No. Sorry, no, none of the Isham. But I did get to see his fixed blade design. Yeah, the uh, really horse nice. crippler. Yes. It's so yes. cool. I saw him the other day and we caught up. And, I was, and he had it on, I'm like, dude, let me see it. <laughs> and he like, pulled, I was like, yes, it's so rad. Yeah. So for me, being the first Blade show that I've attended, what I really liked is just the amount of talent in this one place. It's absolutely insane. I mean, even the after hours party, it's like you're walking through this room with just so much talent in that one spot and it's it's electric it's it's hard to describe that feeling but the amount of people the buzz the connectivity and how this entire industry it's from every walk of life from your general public all the way through your like most famous makers but they're all here on like almost an even platform where you're all here for that same reason that's just for the passion and the enjoyment of this wonderful industry yeah if you, yeah that's that's something that I, I love about the knife industry in general so I I've worked in a couple different industries, and uh, a lot of times you gotta have untouchables, right? Yeah, yeah. Like the dude that's just like surrounded by people, and like they just walk through, and you never get to talk to him. In the knife world, you can talk to everybody. It is you know? incredible. And, and like everybody that. is so kind, and everybody's yeah. and like, you even see like makers that you would think would be like in competition, and they're just talking to each other, hanging yes. out, you know? Yes. Yeah. yeah, sharing ideas, yeah. sharing thoughts and concepts, and yeah. it's just, it's that connectivity that's just amazing. It's about great. This, so. Yeah. I've been watching you guys for so long, and um, I actually was gonna razz Kurt. I wanted to see his uh, his Eleanor scars. Oh yeah, <laughs> he's got uh, three, I think. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. That's crazy. Uh, yeah. Yeah. So <laughs> where is he holding the show down at home? Uh, yep, yeah, yeah, at home, yeah. at home. So hopefully we'll get him a shot show, and then the next play show. We're nice. Open. He's so. a great addition to the team. Yeah, and uh, we, we love Kurt. Man. Obviously, we love, we love seeing Ben, um, oh, yeah. but we know he's got some big business roles, and uh, yeah. But you know, you guys. Are doing a great job it's 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 informative entertainment and it's well done it's professional and you guys have a just a hit show so yeah, I, I appreciate it thank we really you for appreciate your work. the support really yeah the support. thanks man appreciate you talking to us yeah, yeah of course one last thing before yeah. you go uh I, I had to ask what's in your pocket today oh okay so <laughs> So okay, in my pocket today, I, I how I have, many are in your pocket? Yeah, we'll yeah. start with that. Dude, I, got, I, got, I only got three today, uh, okay. which is light for Blade Show, right? Yeah, it's, yeah. it's light for Blade Show. And we were talking earlier about that the the Giant Mouse Biblio. Yes. And I actually had that in my pocket for like a while during the show, but I was like, I should trade out. It's you know, it's Blade Show. I should trade out. Totally get it. So uh, I got my uh, M4 Para Three Blade HQ exclusive. Awesome. And I already love the Para Three, but the M4 just sweetens that deal, right? And that just, those jade handles is oh, just that's dude, sexy. Man. Just just makes it sweet. And then uh, this little thing, I actually stole from our booth, don't tell anybody. <laughs> oh, the Launch 4! Yeah, the Launch 4 in, in our Desert Warrior colors. I literally didn't even know this was here. And I showed up at the booth this morning and I saw this and I was like, cool, I'll put that in my pocket. <laughs> so nice. I'll pay for it, don't worry, I'll pay for it. I'm not Ben, I'm not Ben, I'll, I'll pay for it. Uh, and then... Uh, That's a great video, by the way. Uh, you're yeah, 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 nice Ben stole. <laughs> and then knife-wise, I've dude, I've got this uh, Swiss Army Compact. I haven't carried Swiss Army since I was a kid. And we did a, a Swiss Army video recently. Dude, I have fallen in love with this compact. It's just amazing, like absolutely amazing. So I'm a yeah, big Swiss Army knife fan too. Right? Yeah, 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 and yeah. and I've got I'm making some of my Carta skills for it, okay. and then I'm killing the parcel hook because I got no use for it, and I'm gonna actually hack in a uh, uh, screwdriver. Nice. 
Yeah. Okay. So, that, that'd be the way to go. So yeah. it's kind of like a Spartan and a Tinker uh, exactly. uh, at the same time well, that, that way. That comp, like that thinner compact size, right? Sweet. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So I actually fun. carry a Tinker on me today, yes. but um, it's usually a Spartan. Okay. Because uh, you know when you're when you're somewhere, you want to open up a bottle of wine with the chick, kind of get things going. Yeah. Uh, baby, it's cold outside <laughs> style, you know. Uh, you take you take you gotta, you gotta be and get it going. Yeah. yeah and it, in an office environment, which is where I'm typically at, yeah. you know, you don't want to take out, you know, a high-speed low drag folder, you know, or a little automatic or something like that. Even though you might be a knife bro, you take one of these guys out and yeah. HR is just gonna look at it and keep going, yeah. all right, carry on. Everybody knows what a Swiss Army knife is, nobody cares, you know. Yeah, yeah. yeah and I'll tell you, it's funny about the corkscrew. Uh, so first off, it's got the glasses thing in it, nice. which I love because I wear glasses, right? Yeah. And yeah, then yeah. secondly, I read a hack where you can like untie knots with it. Yes. And uh, it works. Really? Like, yeah, I yeah, have yeah. to try that one of these days. You got I to, man. I, I intentionally, no fingers, so. yeah, I intentionally took a bunch of like different size paracords and like gnarly knots. And I use this thing, and like this thing got every single knot out. What do you know? Yeah. All right. So, it's kind of cool. dude, thank you yeah. so much for taking a moment. Yeah, yeah. Thanks. Awesome. Man. Yeah. It's Zach from Blade HQ. <laughs> Thanks a lot. Yeah.